Question 8, second three marker of the paper. Skincare products contain a mixture of polar covalent, non-polar covalent and ionic compounds. The compounds need to stay mixed within the product. Skincare products also need to spread easily and remain on the skin for a period of time, as well as to provide physical and chemical protection from the sun. In order to do this, skincare products contain a range of chemicals including water, fats and oils, antioxidants, minerals and sunblock. Using your knowledge of chemistry, explain the role of different chemicals in skincare products. Okay, I, do, I must admit I don't like this one. Um, I feel that I would waffle. Um, so trying to break this into something that is going to be easy to keep clear is, is where I would find this difficult. Okay, right. So breaking this down, we are looking for, ex explaining, when it's saying explain the role of different chemicals, so what it tells you is that they contain a range of chemicals including water, fats and oils, antioxidants, minerals and sunblock. Okay, and then you, then they have the kind of what each of these things is being is trying to do. So it says it's a mixture of polar covalent and non-polar covalent and ionic compounds. And it says they need to stay mixed. So for a start, we can take water and fats and oils and explain that they will be soluble in each other if we take water for the polar covalent and fats and oils for the non-polar covalent and water for the ionic, okay? Um, and since you have fats and oils, you could argue if they've got, you've got two sides to that in terms of a hydrophilic hydrophobic bit. Um, you then have to look at uh, the other things they're asking you to do, spread easily, I um, suppose you could argue oils do that. Uh, remain on the skin. So remaining on the skin would be things that are stable, um, which you could go with the minerals or the fats and oils again. Physical and chemical protection. So physical is going to be things like the minerals. Um, chemical protection is going to be your antioxidants. Um, and I suppose the sunblock is also a physical protection as well. Um, as I say, I, I think I would find this one difficult to stay on topic. So be very careful when you're doing it that you are constantly coming back to, am I explaining a role of a chemical in the product? And, you know, if you manage to get three of the different chemicals that they've said, <laughs> like so talk about water, talk about fats and oils, talk about antioxidants, talk about minerals, talk about sunblock, do each of those things then then you should pick up the marks okay um and then use the bit at the top to help you i think i would probably draw a little table to help me to plan it out and then i would take each one in turn and try and talk through each bit i'm um, trying to say something about every of every one of the different chemicals sorry i said i was going to waffle and i probably have there